When we are young, we often think that the whole world revolves on how others treat us. Well, as we grow, we realize that others are others. Sometimes they have good days, sometimes they have bad days, and sometimes we get in their way as they lash out in their own inner unhappiness. And what we learn as spiritual people is what really defines our life is our responses, not so much how we're treated in the beginning. I pray that you are lifted up by God, strengthened by God, so that your responses become optimistic and in God's order. You know, feelings of upset and confusion may indicate that you have something new to learn about how you respond to people and to circumstances in your life. Well, why not start today? Why not start to pray for different kind of responses? You can start today to alter any perceived conclusions about your life. Because something is amiss today does not mean that it must stay that way. Your very future depends not so much on what has happened or may happen to you as much as it depends on how you respond, how you respond to the happenings. What you are thinking and doing right now is very important. Are you developing a positive and a powerful awareness of God's good? Do you remain steadfastly and earnestly a seeker of God's light in all matters? Today, this very moment, begin employing clear thinking and right action with God's help. With practice, you can bring into operation a stronger set of responses for meeting challenge and health and prosperity and harmony will fill your life. I pray that there is an inner quietness in you today, no matter how much noise is going on around you. It says in Isaiah 30, verse 15, in quietness, and in trust shall be your strength.